belongings. She then proceeded to upload photos with bruises to her face and neck, alleging that her husband choked, bit, and hit her. Well, two days ago, she has retracted her claims. She posted this uh, statement on IG. My husband is not an abusive man. He's a loving father despite our disagreements and love lovers' quarrels. I nor my kids are in any danger with him. Any feeling like crying wolf was not cool while others are feeling she truly is a victim of domestic violence. Disturbing mm. to me. I mean, just awful. And who did that if it wasn't him? Like, who did that? And they say so many times the victims tend to want to protect the abuser. Absolutely. So that's what she said to me feels like she wants to protect him. And with her retracting, not only, I mean, he could have, never mind. Uh-huh. Yes, absolutely. Um, this is nothing to play with. Uh, and I, I've actually been in a home with domestic violence. Oh, and I saw what my mother went through and I also saw her end it. Like, so her kids are looking, they're looking for protection. Right. They're looking to be loved. And this is abuse for them just as much yeah. as it is for anyone else. Absolutely. Weird on both sides. Because, let's be honest, if a woman went on social media and mm -hmm. said these things about you and they were not true, would you stay in a relationship with them? You know, thinking, we don't know. So there should be some type of investigation, you know, some type of, of, of visitation at that home yeah. to see that, that everything is okay. But it's like, people have to stop putting things on, I take a beat, you know? Well, that might have been her. This, up, this is the thing, when you do that. All right, Josh, to the ranch. It well, it, like, it's like what you said, Garcelle. She fell in love. She believes him when he promises to change. Victims do this all the, all the time. time. This thing's never going to be settled properly as long as those interfering troops are around. My settlements. You and Chief Yellowfeather are pretty good friends, aren't you? Yeah. Send a man out tonight and have Yellowfeather kick up a rumpus somewhere. And they'll have to pull the troops out. I can have him shoot up a couple of towns. No need to kill anyone. Can you do it tonight? cold weather outside and we spoke to one woman an american woman who has lived and she said it was finally time for her to leave she said howard has since issued a public apology so ladies what are your thoughts Things can go out the window even the repercussions that may be involved so you know five games out i'm i'm sorry that he has to miss it but there has to be some some punishment well i asked him three or four times not to touch me this actually happened because you know, at the very end of the game, mm -hmm. the um, Wisconsin called a timeout, which really wasn't necessary because, you know, and that is what made Ju Juwan mad. He felt like it was, they were already winning the game. Mm -hmm. My take on this is that they need to stop doing the post-game handshake. They can do a pre-game uh, handshake. Mm -hmm. And the reason why I say they should stop doing it, first of all, is be much more competitive. So I think that, to, because this is the first time that this happened also in, in a, number, a number of other colleges. So I think the post-game handshake, mm -hmm. do the pre-game handshake, show sportsmanship. When you talked about repercussions, you're talking 40 grand. Mm -hmm. And let's keep it real, y'all. When you have money, mm -hmm. More money, more problems. People are going to antagonize you. Mm -hmm. They are going to try to rile you up. Cause let me let's let's keep it real. If you have money and you hit somebody, they're gonna sue you. They're gonna sue you. They're, you're gonna get They wanna sue you. He's getting sued by Brandon Bills, who actually was technically antagonizing him. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But the moment you throw that punch, like you said, you everything keep goes out the window. Prepare that you're gonna have something to pay. You know what's so crazy when somebody down like, uh, uh. My first inclination, if that were done to me, I'd get up and want to fight. Yeah. But